dress like how I made myself a sundress but instead of two cutouts she want one cutout this is the dress that I made myself 
So yeah, she wants it to be a midi, one cutout. She don't want the cutout to be as low as mine. She wants to be able to wear her bra and all that. So I think I'm gonna just use, cause she claims she's the same size as me, but but it's stretching material, so it should be able to fit her. But I don't want it to be able to stretch so much to where it gets thin, you know? So I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger, probably like one or two inches bigger. And um, yeah, let's get it started. It shouldn't take me long at all to do this. And oh yeah, the previous clips that you might have saw um, here in Ben Ridge, it be storming. And when it storms, it flood. So I, I had went to work early in the morning, as y'all saw, but um, they had ended up closing. So they had, so we had to stay like a hour longer to, um, cause there were people there already. So we had to stay an hour longer and then we had to close the building. We opened, then we closed it. So yeah. And on my way there, they had like street closures because, you know, it was flooding and all that. So I didn't, I was supposed to go get my lashes done today, but I had rescheduled because I thought it was still going to be storming and stuff. But it looks like that it ain't going to start uh, raining again until about 3 o'clock. But I had already rescheduled, so my next lash appointment is on the 1st, June 1st. And um, I need to get my nails done. ASAP. And I'm thinking about if I should still go today. But I need to get this done because she's leaving soon to get her um to go on vacation. Yeah. So yes, I'm finna time lapse this little clip 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 of me sewing, whipping this dress together. And I'ma use my dress as like a pattern so I won't have to make a whole nother pattern. Since so she claims she's the same size as me, you know. But yeah, let's get it started. So I'm just now getting my finish, getting my nails done. So I wanted um, black French tip nails. And basically that's what I got. But I don't think he fully understood the assignment all the way. But I gotta just make the assignment work. So here's the nails. Of course, it's blurry and don't want to focus. They're low. Okay, so they're low because um, he said I have low nail beds, which I really think I don't. Not these long fingernails. He said I have long nail beds. And uh, he had it to where the fresh chip was higher, but my actual nail was showing underneath because he used such a light color on my actual nail bed i don't know why he used gel because when i be watching other people videos they be using acrylic on it like he used acrylic to form the nail and all that 
with the tip. But people, I see that other people, like when they record them, they mail them, then they use actual acrylic to, like for the color, if that makes sense. He be using gel. He should have he. I mean, I don't mind using gel, but he should use a darker color one. And two, cause I show him a reference picture. On the reference picture, I'm gonna probably put it up, uh, put it on here. But on the picture that I had shown him, the girl she had darker nail beds too. It was still about this color, but it was like more opaque. It was more. It was darker, you know. And also, I messed up. Cause y'all y'all know my nails are usually longer than this. But I guess I deal with it. See, this is why I need to hear if and find me a black nail tech. Cause these Chinese people ain't cutting it. They ain't cutting check. Why is my hair so They ain't cutting it. They not doing enough for me. And then the place they can't do like crazy designs that I be wanting. I'll let each drip. They do the bare minimum. Let's see if I can get this thing to focus. There you go. I mean, they're not ugly, but they're not cute either. Like, okay, I ain't gonna say they're not cute. But they're not like, ooh, we, you know. But I can make it, I can make it work. I don't know why this is so blurry. Oh, yeah, okay, so, um. The other portion is, I think I already talked about this. But basically, we was having severe weather here in my city. And it said that it was supposed to rain, but it's 3 o'clock and it still hasn't rained yet. So, I, I had called off work and everything. I really didn't want to go to work regardless. But I called off. I went to the salon. Oh, yeah. I was supposed to get my lectures done yesterday. Yeah, I was supposed to get my lectures done yesterday, but... It was flooding, it was storming, and I just didn't want to be dealing with all that. So I had I had rescheduled my appointment to June first, all the way to June first, because that was in her next opening. And she she finna get replaced too. These nail people finna get replaced in in this last lady. She do like she do good lashes like quality on point but i'm the type of girl i'm like what's the point of you getting lashes if you're gonna make them look natural if you're gonna make it look like you ain't got none you know what i'm saying i'm not that type of girl if i'm gonna get my nails done if i'm gonna get my lashes done you gonna you gonna tell you gonna be able to tell that i got it in because what's the point of getting it in if nobody can tell so yeah I should do more natural or more of a natural look which ain't nothing wrong with that. But I'll be wanting a little bit extra. A little spicy. Oh, uh, yeah. My aunt, she was at the. My camera just turned off in the middle of me talking. Well, my phone camera. Uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah. Um, like, when I'm going to be doing that thing. All day, then like the nighttime come, I be like, dang, I really ain't doing it all day. And I be like, I could have made something, you know. But I, know, I just think I'm that lazy. Like I like sewing, cause I like seeing the end product. But the process of getting to the end product is the part that I would say I don't like it. But I just wish I could have snapped my fingers and then be there. I got my toes black too, y'all. But I'm finna call my auntie, see what she at, and then I'll hit y'all back up later. Probably when I get the sewing and toe bag.
Hey y'all. I know I ain't pick up this camera in a little minute, but I had wanted to show y'all the um the shoes that I had ordered from egoshoes.com. Uh you can find them on Instagram and stuff. But um yeah, I had ordered some shoes and just a little insight. I wear a size 10. I wear a size eight and a half in men. And with egoshoes.com, I think that's the name of the website. I have to size up a whole size, so I have to order a size 11. And I just wanted to give you a little try on haul, show y'all what I got, and how it fits for reference for y'all.